Northfield Folly. Frank Jane surrenders. Five months after Jesse died, I knew this must be done. I would meet with Governor Cretendon and surrender him my gun. Now those jaykers, those Yankee devils, to this day, I still despise, but honest and constant aliases had led to my demise. I boarded a train for Jefferson City, where I planned to meet this man. I calmly climbed the Capitol steps and placed my holster in his hands. Governor, 21 years now I've been hunted. I've lived out of my saddle, constant on the run. I've let no man touch this gun but me since 1861. I had decided after Northfield I would never ride again. My outlaw days were over. There would be nowhere or when. We had rode in brash and cocky. Now, most folks were ill-prepared, but those boys up there in Northfield, well, they were not a damn bit scared. Our long dasters concealed our weapons, but suspicion filled the air. As far as those Manessitans knew, that weren't what farm folk were. Three of us strode into the bank, right off it all went sour, shooting echoed out in the streets, the outlook now turned dour. Outside, the boys, caught in a crossfire, had tried to buy us time, but prod and badger as we might, we fled, with nary a dime. The bank clerk was a courageous man. He did not have to die, we demanded he open up the safe, the damned fool would not comply. We hightailed it to the horses, but the air was filled with lead, it was hell on earth out in the street, Stiles and Clown Miller lay there, dead. We had rode into a hornet's nest, of that there was no doubt, every man among us wounded, we somehow weaseled out. The bosses were unrelenting, they pursued us night and day, we determined now to split the group, our best chance to get away. Charlie Pitts and the younger set out on foot, me and Jesse, on horseback. Headed southwest, we escaped past roadblocks along the way, it had been days since we'd had rest. The youngers and Pitts, cornered in the swamp, had tried to shoot it out, Pitts was killed, and the younger boys have gone the prison route. As for me, I was acquitted of all my crimes, but I guess you read the news, I've been everything from telegraph operator to a salesman, selling shoes. I'm back here now, living on the farm. I don't ride much anymore, but hop up in the saddle, and I'll give you the 25 cent tour.